Hi everyone, how are you doing? I just came back from a walk. Funny story, I tried to go to the gym and it was closed. This is a holiday here in Israel, holiday eve kind of thing. So <laughs> my gym was closed, I went all the way, I couldn't find anything on Google. I went all the way to the gym, it got closed. I did get something else there, so it wasn't a complete like waste of time, but still. I should have expected that though, because I mean, nothing's open at this point. But what I did ex instead was not to come back home because I, no way I'm getting on my clothes and everything and just come back here and not do anything. So I've decided to do a little walk around um, my area in Tel Aviv. I really like that area. It's kind of to me, so I might be lying here, but it feels to me like I'm looking at it, looking at the architecture, looking at the buildings themselves. I have a feeling like this is the rich area of Tel Aviv. Um, Tel Aviv is super expensive. I think it's the ex most expensive city in the world. So finding a one house that one family lives in, um, in the middle of Tel Aviv is very rare um, and this area was just full of those and they were they were all amazingly built I never see anyone there so I, I feel like it's kind of abandoned like no one goes there um, it's just like an empty um, houses because no one is rich as the price on these buildings are <laughs> uh, or is I walked around there. My goal is to try and get to 10,000 as, as many times as I can, um, which I think you can see. Mm -mm. Trying to show you where is the right way. Oh, it's upside down. Okay, I swear to you, it's 10,000. Um, it's 10,153. I kind of like went back and I reached like when I went on the street, it was almost my street. I was like, oh shit, I'm only at 9,000. Thankfully, I reached the 10,000, um, so I don't need to do anything else today, even though I am going to walk a little bit from here to the car, from the car to the party and everything. I gotta say, it's super hot. Like, I don't know if you can still see on my face, but I'm, I, I'm like, this, you can cook egg on these cheeks. This is how hot it is and <laughs> I think I'm a little bit red still. It's really hot still. It's September, it's almost the end of September. Um, is it though? Yes, it's almost the end of September, almost October, and it's still super hot in Tel Aviv. We don't really have fall here. We are moving from summer to winter, whenever it starts raining, that's when winter comes and we're done. And even talking winter, don't tell anyone, but it's not really winter. It's cute drizzles. I love winter in Israel. It's actually amazing. I think it's for some places in, in the world, it's like almost spring or fall, just without the different colors. Um, everything is super green. Everything is blooming. Everything is beautiful. Like. This is the best time to be in Tel Aviv, I think. I think, I mean, for, in my opinion, a lot of people would love the summer because then you can go into the, in the sea and swim and um, get suntanned on the beach, if that's still a thing, I don't know. Um, not very healthy for your skin, which is something that I bought today. I bought um, sunscreen for my face. Um, I have been neglecting that, so I wanted to go back to doing that. I got something that is like sunscreen and moisturizing as well which is great i hope <laughs> i hope it works on my face this is a very special day here in israel and all over the world if you're a jew um, this is the beginning of the year it's gonna be um this evening gonna be the start of our, the next year um just like uh, new year's eve for um, everyone else in the world or almost everyone else in the world because there's the Chinese New Year and so many others. Um, so, and I love them all because why not have a day to 
set goals and restart <laughs> every day because we kind of forget about our goals and our ideas and hopes and dreams when you're kind of like get used to the day-to-day -day life so we're gonna have a dinner uh, at my parents we're gonna have a lot of wishes we're not very religious we're kind of my parents are kind of um, but I am not religious we are gonna read some blessings I think they're beautiful I think they're um, very unique because usually in our in the blessings we like praise God and everything but here on this holiday we actually bless each other and hope for a great year for a sweet year for a fun year for a happy year for everything so my thing for this new year is or my goal not specifically for the whole year but my goal from for this holiday um, which is a three-day thing um, is to clear up my my closet I have so many clothes I think 95% of the clothes in my closet are not used I don't use them so it's pretty sad and it takes a lot of space and I am dying to buy new clothes so I can't can't put stuff in if you don't have space so stuff needs to go out to go in um, I am not gonna lie I did do a little bit of shopping today I went to the mall because I have I had to check sizes for a ring that we're getting so on the way I got myself some clothes for the holiday um, not some just like an outfit so I got myself if we're talking about it the things that I got myself was this top from and other stories um, I like it it's super cute it's white by the way we love wearing white in the holidays um, so it's perfect for tonight for the dinner and then also jeans from H&M just like a normal 90s it's called 90s baggy here it's called 90s baggy jeans i have no idea what it means i don't see it that much of a 90s kind of thing but i guess it's a thing so i got that um, so i'm gonna wear this attire tonight and then i have a few more clothes that i can um wear for tomorrow which is another dinner i think tomorrow um we're gonna do a little walk in the morning and maybe try to get a little bit of the 10,000 then and then maybe in the evening we'll go on another walk along the beach yeah that's it so before the year starts i know that i mean if you're not if you're watching and you're not a jew that's fine i don't care i just wanted to wish you all a happy new year a fun one um a great one um, full of experiences and smiles and new things that you learned and everything that that you wish for yourself really um, yeah so happy new year mm -hmm.